All right, guys, we are going into the Viridian City Gym, and we are up against the Team Rocket boss, Giovanni. Now, if you guys take a look here, there is the Trainer Rocket, Trainer Lab Man, and Trainer Cool. Now, I mean, if you guys never played or anything like this, you're kind of like, why is there a Team Rocket guy in here? Well, Giovanni is the leader of Team Rocket, uh, as everyone should be aware by now in the year 2023, but back in 1999 or whatever, he was kind of a mystery character. No one really ever saw Giovanni, and anytime you saw him, it was really maybe a movie or it was like a random episode here or there. Um, so for our battle, I'm not gonna use any of the top two teams. But I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to come back here to team number eight. I really like team number eight. So let's choose him to go up against the gym. Uh, the rocket trainer, I think we're probably going to see a lot of Golbats, Raticates. Yeah. Oh, he's got Moltres. Ooh, this is a really random team. He's got Persian, Parasect, Dodrio. Uh, let's go with the Electabuzz. Oh. Electabuzz. The Vaporeon. And I think Alakazam is probably the best choice. I left Charizard and Dragonite there. I don't think we really need to bring them into the battles. But here we go with the Electabuzz. <laughs> That's actually a pretty good matchup against this Parasect because obviously we have Psychic. So let's get that going. I never noticed that there was a number in that name. Okay, he's going for the spore. Hopefully we don't actually get knocked out by this. Oh, lots of spores. Now it is a bug type too, I guess. So Psychic really probably wasn't the best choice, but. Ooh, he's going for the growth. He's gonna boost up his special. Interesting. Let's go for the body slam next. Yes, we woke up. That's good. He's going to go for another growth. That is going to be huge. He's boosting up his stats there, guys. That's actually kind of scary. Hopefully Body Slam can do something to him. Maybe get a Paralysis or something. There we go. Thankful, thankful. Mega Drain. Ooh, that's going to do a lot. Oh. Interesting. He has two... He has two growths, and he went for Mega Drain. I would have thought that would have done a lot more damage than it did. Interesting. Gen 1 nonsense. <laughs> Rambling on. <laughs> Let's get another Body Slam. We might have actually ended up selecting a Psychic. But, uh... You gotta, be, you gotta be careful with your with your stick when you're choosing your moves, because you never know exactly what it's going to. Because if you do it in a different like diagonal, uh, it could choose one or the other. But uh, it looks like Dodrio's next, and uh, again, it also has a number in its name, so that's kind of cool. Um, obviously, we're going for the Thunderbolt. Oh, it's Golbat! Oh, it's Golbat! The remaining Pokemon count is three to one. All right, we should be able to take out this Golbat. I can't see it surviving a Thunderbolt. How's that? Golbat one. <laughs> there we go, guys. So that is the Team Rocket Grunt gone. Now we've got, I think, a scientist and a cool trainer before Giovanni. End of the battle. Okay, let's go. Going up against the lab man. Hello, lab man. Trainer number two. Okay, he's got a cooler team than the previous one. So he's got Hitmonchan, Kabutops, Magneton, Polyrath, Fero, and Lickitung. Mm -hmm. 
So right off the bat, Rhydon's not a good choice. I think I might just go with the Electabuzz again, to be honest. Uh, Dragonite. Okay, so Electabuzz, Alakazam, and Dragonite for our next crew through. Okay. Let's go for the Thunderbolt here. Hopefully we can outspeed this Polyrath. It does hold on. Nine hit points. What will the trainer do nice. Love that animation. That's so cool. What a Excuse me while I roll around on the ground. Okay, Polyrath is down. Oh, is it down and out? Yes, it is. Because electric versus water, be? electricity always wins. Kabutops. Now, he is a rock type Pokemon as well, so we could potentially have some issues with that. Uh, I don't know if Thunderbolt's gonna really work here. Yeah, it does, okay. It's just the ground typing. If there's a ground type, you're not going to be able to get any kind of thunder moves off. But uh, rock typing... I mean, rock is not really effective against electricity, but it does do some damage uh, when there's other typings with it, of course, I think. I think that's how that works. I don't know. I never use electricity versus rock type Pokemon, so... Here we go with the Thunderbolt. The Pharaoh should be just one-shotted. Can't see it living. <laughs> I kind of wish we saw Lickitung. Lickitung would have been a cool Pokemon to see. So now we're up against, what, the Cool Trainer, I think? I'm really surprised we saw Moltres already. All right, here we go, Cool Trainer, let's go. Get into the next match. Okay, this one has Zapdos. So, Omastar, Dodrio, Tentacruel, Pinsir, Zapdos. Yeah, okay. Electric, electric, electric. Obviously, Electabuzz. I'm going to choose the same ones we had last time. The Electabuzz. Zapdos, eh? Let's go for the Body Slam. I think he has really good defense, so I don't know if this will work, but we'll see what happens. Yeah, he has really good defense. I was kind of hoping for the Paralysis with the Body, body Slam, but... Let's go for our own Thunder Wave. Thunder. I can't see that doing very much. Sweet. That's exactly what we wanted to have happen. What will it do? Oh, the attack missed. Neither one is conceding. Let's get that feet. psychic there one more time. Maybe we can get another special drop. What now? There, it's a That's hit. a way better hit than we had before. And we get the paralysis. The All right. The intense battle continues. Let's get the psychic. What's that? Nice. Critical hit. No chance for Zapdos surviving at all. What will the next Pokemon be? Oh, Dodrio. Alright, Dodrio. How will the type difference affect that? He's gonna go first because I'm paralyzed, but if I can live an attack, that Thunderbolt's gonna be huge. What's this? Powerful strike! 
29 hit points, eh? Here we go. Thunderbolt. Nice. Nice one shot. Nice and clean fainting right there. That's awesome. Clefable. Fable, eh? sir. I'm, def I'm definitely not going to be able to take a Clefable with Electabuzz, but. Seismic Toss, that's just gonna finish it. I'm gonna bring in Dragonite. I think Dragonite's the best choice here. Dragonite. It's Dragonite. The remaining Pokemon stock is two to one. The combatants are making. Let's go for the body slam first. Hopefully it doesn't have Blizzard. What'll it do? Real that weak spot. Has seismic toss. <laughs> what now? Buddy, what are you doing? It's a Dragonite. Go for like an ice move or something. What a Go for a sing, put it to sleep. Let's go for the hyper beam. Let's finish it off Gen 1 style. Hit the weak spot. Hit the weak spot. All right, so this means that we are up against Giovanni here next. That is the last and final battle of Viridian City Gym. And if we can get this, we can get the Earth Badge. Continue, please. Very typical Giovanni team. So he's got Persian, Dugtrio, Nidoqueen, Nidoking, Rhydon, and Tauros. I'm hoping this is the right team to take, but... We're going to go with Dragonite, we're going to go with Vaporeon, and Alakazam. Let's go for the Body Slam. Oh, Blizzard, come on. It's not a good, not a good swap. <laughs> no paralysis. Okay. Let's go to Vaporeon. And then I think the first thing I'm going to have to do is Acid Armor. Don't you dare freeze me. Really? Ugh. You gotta be kidding me. What's that? Damn the weak spot. It's frozen rock salt. Neither one is succeeding an inch. What's this? There it's a hit. It can't make a move. Come on, Vaporia. You can get out of that continue. ice. This is ridiculous. How? No, clearly not. Goes for the stomp. And that's going to take Vaporeon. What am I going to do here? He's faster than my Dragonite. I don't think he's faster than my Alakazam. But if Alakazam gets hit, that's it. It's gone. Uh, I'm going to have to obviously go for Psychic. Oh, it's Alakazam! How will the type difference affect that? If I go for Thunder Wave, I'm going to lose Alakazam right away. What now? Oh, right. It's finally taken down! 
I can't believe he froze my Vaporeon. I'm like, please don't do it, and then bam, it did it. I should just not ever say that again. <laughs> All right, Rhydon. All right, you are ground and rock type Pokemon. I understand. Let's go for the Psychic here. Not enough to knock him out, though, but he's going for the Earthquake. That is going to be probably really devastating to Alakazam. We actually live that. I can't believe that. Let's go for another Psychic. Right on. There's only one Pokemon left in reserve. Persian. Oh, it's Persian. The remaining Pokemon stock is. I'm just gonna go for the psychic. The tenth battle continues. Vigorous attack. Heart blow. Slash. Okay, Alakazam's gonna go down. Okay, we still have Dragonite. What do you guys think? Should we end this Gen 1 style? Go for the Hyper Beam. We're down to one Pokemon aside. I hope I can outspeed that Persian. I'm also really hoping it doesn't have Blizzard. I don't know if it gets Blizzard, but I feel like it does. There's just one Pokemon aside now. Let's go for the Hyper Beam. That's Slash. Oh, please don't take my Dragonite. What now? Thrill that weak spot. <laughs> yes! Oh my god, that was a close battle. That freeze, though. That freeze from that Tauros was like the ultimate, like, in your face moment. Alright guys, so we actually ended up taking out Giovanni, which is the 8th and final gym of Kanto. So now we have only one place left to go, and that is the Elite Four. So, let's see if this unlocks that there now. So we've received the key from Giovanni, and it opened the gate to the last castle. And if I'm not mistaken, I think we have to take all of these trainers in a row. <laughs> So, if you enjoyed that battle or that uh, little scrimmage against the Viridian City Gym, uh, be sure to post your comments. I'd like to hear from you guys. What do you guys think about that Vaporeon freeze? That was huge. So post your comments. I'd like to hear from you. Take care. Have a good one. And I'll see you guys when I go up against the Elite Four of Gym Leader Castle. Peace out.